You just flew on an airplane. You can handle an escalator. Are you ready? It's what we're doing, okay? Hey, can you can you show me go? Oh yeah, this go is fly. On the vlog. So what are we doing, Ben? <laughs> we're on our Uber. Go no, we're not <laughs> fly. <laughs> What's up guys, welcome to the vlog. We are out of the house. We are headed back to Florida. It's gonna be a fantastic trip. I'm thinking positive thoughts. We've already had a couple meltdowns today. Not not like uh, sensory meltdowns, like anger stuff. Uh, biting herself, then she attacked Isaiah. So she got, she got moved to this seat because she could grab Isaiah from behind and um, she beat up her brother. Let's just, Don't tell them that. Well, I mean, it's kind of what happened. Yeah, okay, she jacked me up. We don't have to tell the whole, like, million people that watch this that. <laughs> oh, it's not a million. It's gonna be like 40,000 people in the first 24 hours. No big deal. So this could make for an interesting day. We're traveling in the middle of the day. Why are we traveling in the middle of the day? So when you're flying back to the East Coast, yeah. these are your options. Oh, because, because the time change. The time change. Okay. All right. Well. So it was it was either do this or do an overnight one, and I was like, yeah, that's not happening. Right. Could Everybody on the plane trying to sleep. Right. Yeah. So I did as much as I could, and I was like, well, at least on our second half is our nighttime bed time. Yeah. So that'll help. We had Abby watching the video this morning of her flying again. She was into it. I don't know. If she's happy about it. Um, I don't know. Definitely different behavior than we've had the rest of the trip. We haven't had that that much anger. You okay? A little overwhelmed? Can put your backpack on? It's okay, Ab. It's okay, kiddo. It's all right. You okay? Good. Leave her alone. You ready? Let's get her inside, away from the buses. She hates air brakes. Go with mom. Hold mom's hand, okay? Go hold mom's hand. Let's get you inside. Take good care of you, Ab. How nice is this, huh, Abby? She's smiling, that's good. She's like, that's the worst news ever. I know, she likes taking her shoes off. I mean, she can if she wants. No, it's all right. It's one less thing we have to do. Yeah. Uh, no, no, go stand over here. 
Make that serving job. Awesome job, guys. Thanks so much. We have flown a few times with her, and this is the best one yet. So. Yeah, we try. Yeah, I was like, uh, we are not using this right now, so just yeah, it up. we we've been overly impressed with it, with LA in general. So, yeah, we. Yeah. Well, I think we've had the PSS program kind of the longest. So okay, cool. There's a few of us that have been doing these for a while. Gotcha. So, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, we're pretty pretty cool with it. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. All right. So he said they've had the PSS program the longest. Oh. Yeah, so they're the most experienced with it, but that kind of killing. Yeah, they, they that was awesome. Yep. Great job, LAX. It's like going to Disney, Ab. You get your fast pass, front of the line. Oh look! Oh look at that! We're right here. Oh, the day is looking up. Um, She's calm. Yeah, you were happy. That owl. That owl's been awesome that we got from a subscriber. <laughs> She loves squeezing it. Why are you getting excited? Getting excited as we're getting on the plane. Goodness sakes. Thank you. Let's go. Last row. Nobody behind us for her to rock against. Come on, kiddo. Yeah, it works. That's you right there. There you go. Take that. Here, come back here for a second. Come here, follow me. Is it funny? Is it funny? Somebody else is head. <laughs> Doing good. Just a little bumpy. You know, he's up and down, up and down. Just, just put it down. Yeah. I mean, not quickly, you know. It's funny that we just talked about, or we just read a comment, somebody said that we need to discipline Abby more to stop these behaviors. So that, and I know most of you understand, but so that everyone understands, like, if I were to smack her hand because she's touching somebody's head, or yell at her. I don't know that they mean smack or like, her hand. Or like, well, you know what I'm saying, like, no. You know, like, swat it down. Um, or like, raise my voice, or tell her that she's in timeout when she gets home, or I don't know. I don't know what, what they mean by discipline. What do they mean by discipline? So, like, that would just, that would make it worse, 10 times worse. She, she, she feeds off of that right. stuff. And then it becomes a game, like, yeah. It'd be terrible. Constantly, constantly. So the only thing we can do is block it and ignore it so it becomes boring for her. Right. Hopefully, you know, it, so is it a sensory thing or is it a behavioral thing? I think it's a behavioral thing because it gets a reaction out of people uh, by the person sitting in front of her and out of us. So if we ignore it, hopefully it, it, it stops. The problem is we don't ride on planes enough <laughs> to change the behavior. Right. So, ride on a plane and that's like the day. only time it happens. <laughs> Yeah, like, okay, let's get the ABA therapist and go on a plane ride yeah. and see if we can fix this. How was the yelling? I, well, you heard her. 
like once or twice. Oh, did you? Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. She yelled too much. probably a dozen times. Yeah. About a dozen. Okay. Yeah, not super loud. We usually stopped it, you know, early. The very young French girl next to me. Yeah. Every time she's, she's watching Aquaman, every time I yelled, she go. Yeah, she, I know was she was. Funniest thing. I waved I to her like, a couple of times. Yeah, I, I would just smile and she'd be like, she'd smile back and turn back to her movie. She was just curious, I think. I don't yeah. think there was anything rude there. Different culture. Yeah. Abby is done. This has been the uh, this has been the hardest one yet. I think like just the most. She said the hardest time out of out of any. Flight. Any series of flights, so this might this might be the hardest flight. We'll see. Struggling a little bit. She doesn't like Dallas, I think. I think that's why it is. She doesn't like Texas. I'm sorry, Texans. She's not a fan. I know. And there's lots of staring here. It's an international airport, though, so there's like people from everywhere. So. You never know what's going on. We're lots of lots people of people like, looking. I hope they're not on our flight. Yeah, <laughs> I mean it's not like a like oh stop staring at us. Like <clears throat> I mean how can you not look? Like she's making a ton of noise. We we get that totally, but it's just it's tough, huh? We'll make it through. We only got a few more hours. Like four. Listen, we're gonna go. You wanna go? Okay, we're gonna go on the plane, okay? And they got yeah. snacks. See, they you're got not. Drinks, she's not defiant thing. of getting on the plane. Yeah. Like that's not the problem. It's just she's just overload, you know. <laughs> it's also that time of the night, so. Yeah. You got it. Yep, right. you're gonna do fine. Keep your chewy. Good job. You okay? It's hard, huh? Yeah. It's one of those situations like you wish you could just bail, but you can't because we're in Dallas, Texas. <laughs> I know. She'll be okay. At least she made herself known before we got on the plane, right? Yeah. It's okay. Hey, I don't know. You know what? I think it's you you ready? Are you good? I got you. Are you okay? Yeah. You want to talk to him? Yeah. Okay. Squeeze your pillow. Squeeze your pillow. There you go. Uh, so she was having a little bit of a hard time a, a minute ago, but she's calmed down a little bit. So. Oh, get a good squeeze. There you go. Hey, do you want to say hi? Do you want to say hi to the pilot? She said thank you. <laughs> she said, I'll go up to her and Abigail. Say hi. Here, I'll hold that. Good job. Good wave. Don't get too jerky on the wheel. Okay. Just want to thank you. Yep. There you go. Squeeze. You got it. Thank you.
on Sunday. Oh, Monday. <laughs> Monday. Isn't that crazy? Oh my goodness. We're very excited about camp. Are you ready to go home? Are you ready? You ready to go home? Yeah. You ready to go to bed? Are you tired? It was that bad of a flight, I cried too. <laughs> Abigail, sweet girl. Oh my goodness. That guy right there, the one in front with the white shoulder bag, nice guy. Super nice guy. Yeah. He walked by and said, you guys are awesome. <laughs> Me wanting to leave you on the plane. <laughs> I know, awesome. Aww, she's having such a hard time. <laughs> such a mess. I know. Hey, we're just going home. I know nothing I say is going to make it better. You just feel like crap, but we're going home. That was the longest, uh, longest trip we've ever had. Yeah. It was not enjoyable. Yeah. That wasn't fun. I'm not going to be positive about that. <laughs> no, I mean, it, it sucked. It, it sucked. It started off with with melt, the yelling and then meltdowns and then <laughs> uh, some like super excited thrashing in her seat type of behavior. Um, you know, nobody wants to just like walk through an airport and attract everyone's attention. Hey. Nobody wants that. That's all there's to it. I mean, I, you know, not saying the, a lot of the people we came in contact with were amazing and just amazing humans and the world's full of amazing humans i got something don't be afraid to go out in public and go out and do things and get on an airplane because you're worried about what other people are going to think it's i'm not saying it's not going to be stressful but 99.9% .9 of people i'm sorry you're okay 99.9% .9 of people are, are um, understanding and friendly and positive and like every time that you cried was preceded by somebody saying something you know that guy that, that, said, that you uh, got it that guy said you can do it abby you guys got it yeah just keep walking we were sitting down and, okay. yeah and abby he had heard us say your name so he said you got it abby i'm appreciative to those people around us because nobody i don't care autism or not nobody wants their kid to cry or cause ruckus like it's just as stressful for the parents. Absolutely. It's not just like, oh, she has autism, so you gotta deal with it. Like, right. it's, like it sucks for everybody. Was, Nobody wants their kid to do that. It was an awful flight for us because I was just, I was stressed the whole time. Like, I was like, I don't wanna be, I don't wanna have my headphones on watching this movie. Like, I'm not <laughs> involved with her. Like, and then we tried to give her music and then she would only listen to her for a minute. And then, the, but, uh, but the crying, like, nothing was stopping the crying. It was like 45 minutes, would you say? Yeah. 45 minutes straight of crying except for every once in a while she would do this maniacal laugh and then go right back into crying and she's just tired she's exhausted she's overly tired she's been up since 5 a.m so she got up a couple hours before we needed to even to leave for our flight guys we're tired we're going to bed we're gonna go home and just crash and um hopefully we'll see you tomorrow bye bye are you happy to be home good night love you Aw, thanks for the kisses.